And now, for your eyes only, a journey through Yoshi's Island. Do you find yourself unchallenged? Hey, been there. Do you feel like something is missing from your life? Young man, got the high score on that one? Could it be that you're not getting enough Mario in your diet? Introducing the game you've been waiting four long years to play. Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. Available only on Super NES. A game like you've never played before. With all new enemies, new levels. And oh yeah, this time, you play Yoshi. K-Mac has kidnapped baby Luigi. Baby Mario escapes K-Mac's clutches and falls onto Yoshi's back. Use the map to help the Yoshis and baby Mario rescue Luigi. Journey safely through Yoshi's Island to return them to their parents in the Mushroom Kingdom. Hold on, big boy. Uh, where am I? Well, you've entered the world of Nintendo. What am I doing here? In order to learn all the secrets about this game, you're going to have to journey through Yoshi's Island. So, uh, which way do I go? You're going to go that way. That way? Yes. All right, thanks. No! I am completely lost. Well, we can get around to that, Josh, but first I think you need to learn some more about Yoshi's Island. So what makes this game so different, though? You think you can keep a secret? I can keep a secret. Okay, then I'm going to tell you about more information. We have backgrounds that wave where you're line scrolling vertically and horizontally, different scrolls of the background. Okay, then you have scaling where we do things like you'll have a little tiny enemy in the background and you're thinking, that guy's way back there, I don't have to worry about him. You know, so you're cruising along, all of a sudden he just leaps out of the background, boom! And we have some other effects in the game, like you'll be walking along and all of a sudden this background will just come out of the background and just squish you flat like a pancake, just boom, pancake. Now that's unbelievable. Now you gotta tell me real quick about the graphics. The graphics of the game are cool. Yeah. And when we made Yoshi's Island, they wanted to have a different look. You know, so they, they do something that almost looked like a sketch. They're kind of like hand-drawn. I think that was the look that, that they were going for when they designed Yoshi's Island. One of the first things you notice is the clouds are like, you know, swimming. <laughs> so, you know, the, the trees are blowing and blowing rocks, you know, rocks are, are rolling. Rock getting rolling. Yeah, that's right. But in general, you're morphing into things in Yoshi's Island. So you can find hidden areas and secret things so that you can finish the game perfectly. Well, what else can you tell me about this game? Well, there's not much I can tell you anymore. You're going to have to figure out the rest on your own. What are you guys doing here? Well, we've been playing a lot of Yoshi's Island lately. What's with the water watermelon, by the way? Well, you see, Josh, in this game, you get these red, blue, and green watermelons that give you these different abilities. With the red ones, what you do is you take that and you get fire, and then you can uh -huh. burn them. Yeah. Hey, what's with the two funky arrows? Okay, since I'm tentatively titled the Egg God around here, I'll show you how to use those arrows. Okay. Um, you use these arrows by tossing the eggs into them, and you can bounce them off the walls. Cool, so like a ricochet? Cool. Exactly, or a bank. Wow. Bada bing! Okay, so how many different color eggs we got now? Well, let's see, we've got red. Red. We've got green. Green. Yellow eggs can help you get the stars. Stars? Stars, pretty much, they help you get uh, bonus levels. Now, you got snow, you got water. Are those pretty much the, the levels, the same? There's six worlds in the game with, with eight levels in each. And if you can get all of the things you need to get a bonus, you can open up a hidden world. Wow. And another bonus game. So there's about ten things for each world. So there's over 60 levels. You got to get um, 30 stars and 20 coins and also the five flowers. Collect them, why? Um, to get the hundred points, which will get you the bonus level. How many different enemies you got on these things? Um, there's like over a hundred in the game. I pretty <laughs> much get rid of them really fast anyway, though. Oh my goodness, what's that thing that's growing on the screen right there? This is one of the coolest parts in the game. This is one of the big bosses that do the morphing stuff. Uh -huh. The cool thing about this is, is he's like a jelly substance, and you've got to use the eggs to rip a path to the middle of him. I got oh! it! Oh! Right on the edge!
Man, we are the video game testers. And what are you doing, brother? I am cruising through the game, morphing into a submarine. Into it? You're changing into a sub? Just did it. Shoot, no, what are those? Those are little torpedoes. Little torpedoes when they just find the bad guys? You got it. And what did you just jump on there? Um, that's a little box where you hit it and you get extra tips. Yoshi will pound the ground. And sometimes you can find extra items that way, too. Wow. So you what do we got going on? Well, I'm going to shoot the eggs at him. You can see, he gets a little mad. That's it. There you go. Nice. Ah, yeah, that's right. That's Good right. shot. Check this out. You're on a mat. It's going what is perfect. it? Is that, what is it? Been there. Done that. Try this. in October, Super Mario World 2, Yoshi's Island, only on Super NES.